In the previous lesson, we modulated the amplitude of an oscillator using the signal of another one. In this lesson, we are going to modulate the frequency of an oscillator with another oscillator. As most of you probably already know, this sound synthesis method is called frequency modulation synthesis, or FM. It allows for the synthesis of sounds with a very rich and complex spectrum. Here we are going to use it to make a polyphonic MIDI synthesizer. In this FM circuit, the frequency of a sine wave oscillator, which here is the carrier, is modulated by another sine oscillator, here the modulator. The modulation index slider controls the amount of modulation applied to the frequency of the carrier. Its range is 0 to 1000 here, but in practice, it can be unlimited. Note that we don't need to scale the range of the modulator as we did in the previous lesson for amplitude modulation, as we want the frequency of the carrier to oscillate around a certain value, which is defined here by the modulator frequency slider. Note that we named the slider controlling the carrier frequency freak since we wanted to be controlled by MIDI events as we did in the previous lessons. Let's try to run this code and see what happens, Jan. Beautiful. Should we try to play with some parameters? Index, frequency. We can reuse the envelope circuit uh, from the previous lesson in this code to turn it into a polyphonic MIDI synthesizer. So Romain, let's uh, turn the polyphony on and run the code. Sure. Turn the polyphony on, run the code. And here the keyboard. Oh, I wonder what I'm going to play this time. Yeah, let's try to be... Wow. Read your this tune. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. Just came like this, you know. So fantastic. Yeah.